we are pretty bullish uh, in our program about what we believe. We strongly, strongly encourage play high school soccer. Play it. Um, for a lot of reasons. One, Chris, our associate head coach, he was a, he was the Webster uh, high school girls soccer coach for 10 years. So, you know, right. he's obviously, and that's where I found him um, and, and brought him into SLU. But the reason being, uh, there's a couple things. One, you are playing with uh, athletes of all different ages. So as a freshman, you're playing against, you know, older 17, 18 year olds, which is very similar to what you're going to go do in college as a freshman, go play against 22 year old women. It's a, there's an athletic jump there. And so, you know, that's just the challenge it presents. The second being go represent your school, your community, even if it's a private school, but go represent, like you're a part of that community. It's a unique, some of the high school crowds will be bigger than some of these women will ever play in front of in college. And it, right. it's a pretty special experience there. The other piece is high school soccer can give you tools and, um, opportunities that maybe a club environment stifles. And the best the best example I'll give is Emily Gaby. I go back to her kind of Lufuse product. She, she's from Union, Missouri. She went to Union High School. And uh, Union was not known to be a, a you know, girl soccer powerhouse by any means. But what Emily learned how to do is score goals in all different ways because it was Emily versus the world. Get her the ball and she'd just slice and dice. It'd be 1v5, 1v6. And I'll, I'll be honest, and I'd say this if she was sitting across from me, I was not sold on Emily as a youth player in the club atmosphere. I was kind of like, ah, does it fit? Does it work? And Chris was like, go watch her play high school soccer. Go watch her play. I go, I go drive my, you know, drive myself out to <laughs> drive Union. Down, and drive down, down, down out there. Farty far. Down, farty far. <laughs> and uh, I would watch Emily score three, four, five goals a game. And my God, it was something special. And my, it's exactly the player we now are seeing absolutely dominate the college scene. I mean, we were playing against... Georgetown, Penn State, and NCAA tournament, and those coaches are like, where did you find her? I mean, she was making all American center backs look like children because of uh -huh. her abilities. And, and so... Did again, you say just past Six Flag Mid-America? <laughs> just, exactly. <laughs> down, yeah. un, down Union. Uh, she has a pet cow named Winston. It's a lovely, uh, <laughs> lovely story. Um, but again, without that high school... Now, she played for Lufus, you know, and she, she was on a very... I think they were a USYS national championship team. And nothing against that team, but like she didn't have those same opportunities to develop her game in the club setting because she was more defined to a given role than she was kind of given free reign in the high school.